Hey, hey everyone. Welcome back or welcome if you are new. It is the long awaited giveaway video. My name is Tara. This is Life of Redette. I got some noises going on. I got a TV on going. I got a car thinking it's racing going outside. I think it's thundering. So I apologize for all of the noises. We have a giveaway. Now, is it as big as I would have loved to have done it? Probably not. I am going to try to save that for my 1,000 subscriber video. You guys, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Thank you. I love you all. All right, before we get into the prizes, we're going to go over the rules and all of that, okay? So, my very sloppily, quick writing handwriting. <laughs> all right, so the video, once it airs, it ends on Saturday, May 18th at 11.59 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yes, I am in West Central, or no. Yeah, West Central Indiana, and we are on Eastern Time. I have no clue. But anyways, that's neither here nor there. Thank you, Mitch Daniels. Anyways, so the winners will be announced on May 20th on my Monday Minis video. I will give you a week from that video to get with me, and if I have not heard from you I will redraw another name um yeah <laughs> that's happened a lot unfortunately let me zoom you guys in just a little bit so anyways yes we'll talk about that later rules you must be publicly subscribed I will check I do check um yeah I I do check I mean I I it might not seem like a lot but it's a lot of money I spent um for my subscribers so if you're not a subscriber, you don't plan on subscribing, don't, you know, don't enter. And if you're not publicly subscribed, I will show you here in a minute how to be able to check really easy to see if you're publicly subscribed. Because some people don't know that they're not publicly subscribed. And for us YouTubers, if it's not showing that you are, have your subscriptions public, we don't know if you're actually a subscriber of ours or not. So, yes. Um, next rule, you must be 18 or older or have your parents' permission because you will have to give me your name and your mailing address unless I've mailed something to you in the past and then I have that. And just like this video. That'd be great and a heart for you. Um, I will let you know I will not be commenting on the video unless you ask a specific question. Um, I Feel like it just bogs down the comments but I will heart your comment if you're just like saying something and then entering the giveaway that's totally fine yay but if you ask me a specific question or something I will answer you anyways let me I'm gonna show you really quick you know I gotta get my my iPad out here and um here okay so if you don't know Mrs. Summer's budget go watch her but they started a vlog channel so I was watching this just before I did this video. But anyways, I'm going to show you how you can tell if you are a public subscriber or not on somebody's channel. And this works on your phone and your tablet. I'm not sure about laptops, but I'm going to show you. Okay, so I'm going to try to hide other people's stuff here. Okay, but I want to show you. Here's my comment to Stephanie and Brian. So if you click your little icon right here, you, whoa, that's so close. Sorry. Do you see it says public subscriber right there? That means your subscriptions are public and it shows my subscriptions, you know, and all that. But, um, like I said, I'm going to try to hide everybody else's um, stuff. But I just want to kind of click on somebody. Let's see if... Sorry. I'm sorry for calling you out if, if you're not. Okay. So, this person, I will cover up their name. They don't have the public subscriber. That means their subscriptions are not public. So, yes, that's how you can tell very, very easily if you don't have that button pushed. And it's really simple to do. I've explained it before. And just Google it. I mean, it literally takes you two minutes to do it. So, yeah. Anyways, thanks, Steph, for letting me use your video <laughs> to do that. Anyways, we're going to start off. I don't know how many prizes I have. How many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, 11, 12, 14. 14 prizes. So, the first 
11 are open to anyone international or US um, just because they are just in an envelope um, like this. Whoa, I'm easing me back out. I'm so sorry. They are in an envelope just like this. So, you know, it's, it's easy to ship. I've learned my lesson with sh shipping big packages overseas. Sorry, it's it costs more to ship it than the price is worth. Anyways, so this first one is hashtag animals. And I want to thank everybody that I bought from because we did fabulous. Now, you, there are some people who have more than one challenge in a bundle. That's because I loved the challenges. So first we have my bestie, Steph's on a budget. This is her yarn squirrel. And you get, and this is, these are ones I love. You get to decide the amount of the yarn or the acorn. So cute. And then of course, Liz's ranch on the ranch. I wanted to save this for myself, but I did not. So one of these days I will purchase it again because I've never done it. And that one is save 75 for the top, 125 for the bottom. If you add the two together, it's 200. If you times the numbers together, it's 760. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, you guys know this. This is my friend Desiree from Debt Free by 43. This is the boot, the snoot. She does have two more versions out, you guys. They are both in my cart. I am waiting patiently. But anyways, yes. And then, and then, this is budgeting by Dina US. I love this. This is $45. It's a pig. <laughs> She's so cute. And hers are always double-sided. Look. It's adorable. This one's $85. It was very hard. I got ones that I would love. So, if you don't like them, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alright, and then we got this $50 dolphin one from Save with Judy. So beautiful. Okay, so those are it. There's like five challenges in each envelope. So... I tried to spread the love. So that's hashtag animal. All right, we're gonna do hashtag camping because you know it's not a Tara, you know, video without camping. And of course, I had to, again, order Miss Adventure from Liz. I still have yet to do this one. <laughs> I need to, but yes. And then we got this from Rocks, her Smortastic. It's $50, you guys. Look how cute. Yes. And then, <laughs> gotta love her. Chris, Chris Gilmore at Tewatu. Welcome to quit your, oh, welcome to camp quit your bitchin'. <laughs> if you're not a ham, happy, I can't dog, it's so funny. If you're not a happy camper, take a hike. This is save $100, denominations one through 10. And then another one from Chris. This one is Camp Cram a Lot. This one's $50. So this one's just woo! Tent camping. Tent camping. This is me. Tent camping. No. And then another one from Miss Save with Judy. Look how beautiful this camper is. This one's $75. I love this. Hashtag camping. Um, if you see somebody down in the comments who misspelled something or didn't do, hey, let them know. I, I look, but sometimes I miss, you know. But just let them know, hey, you misspelled or something. Because there's a lot going on. And the reason these have check marks, if you are wondering, is because that means I got every <laughs> I got everything for this one. This next one is hashtag Christmas. And I want to tell you what, I actually had so many Christmas challenges. I didn't buy, I mean I bought all these, but I didn't buy them for this giveaway. But I had so many that there was no way I was ever gonna get them all done. So I wanted to put in some fun ones for you guys. Um, I mean, not that I don't love them, it's just, <laughs> there's so many. But anyways, this one from Budget with Carly, love her. Have a Merry Clucking Christmas. This one's $150. That one's awesome, I love this. And then this one is from Fairy Rose Cottage. It's her Frozen one with, what, what is his name, Olaf. And Elsa and Anna and what's that guy's name? Oh lordy, I can't remember. Anyways, doesn't matter. Save 100. This one is from Ellie on Earth. This is $80. One of her vintage um, Christmas ones. And then this cute one from Champagne's Corner with the cookies and the cup 
cupcakes and the hot chocolate. Oh, so beautiful, 75. And then, oh, that one got scratched a little, I think from being in the envelope. I hope you guys don't mind. It's got a little ding there on the things. Anyways, this is one from Snow Garner 307. This is Marlene. This is Christmas on my mind. I love this one with all the hair lights and everything. I'm, I don't know. I don't know. And then on the back, it's a color. So I'm going to put that one that way so maybe it won't get scratched anymore. I knew putting them, taking them in and out of the envelopes might cause that. But I'm so sorry. All right. Hashtag Christmas. And you guys know. Hashtag cow, cow. We got cows. We got cows. I did not, did I? I think I ordered one of these for me. Steps on a budget, you know. The yarn cow. This one's $65. <laughs> it was very hard for me not to keep this one. It says, yeah, no, you know what? I bought one for myself too, I think. I don't know. Yes, I talk to myself. Sometimes I need expert advice. And of course, this is from Lindsay. Boy, mom loves to save. Of course. Look, <laughs> budgeting by Dina US. Look, look at the little Highland cow on the flamingo. This, <laughs> this side's 40 and this side is 90 and they're snorkeling. Oh my God, I love it. And then another one from Dina. This one's just a little cow sitting on a beach in a chair. This one's 90. And then this one, <laughs> this one's 45. It's like got a little cow print skirt on. I love that one. And then, okay, Laura Bell Creations. I've never gotten from Laura Bell before. Laura Bell, Laura, never bought from her before, but I am so glad I did because oh, I love them. Save 40, this is denominations one through six, heifer please, <laughs> of course. Yes, I hope you guys love these because I just get a little kick out of these. I think they're hilarious. All right, that's hashtag cow. And, oh, and, and if you guys haven't figured out, I did take your advice and I did make the challenges myself instead of trying to wait. I still have not received my order, which is a bummer because I mean, you know, obviously I, I ordered that stuff for you, but also because I don't want that seller to feel bad that I didn't get the order. It's not their fault. Um, this one, Liz and Les, enjoy the show. This is hashtag date night, one word. Hashtag date night. And then this one is from Living on a Tiny Budget, Laura. And I just kept it in the wrapper. It's a little um, guy. It's, it's funny because it's retro, but the guy's all tatted up on his neck. <laughs> I love it. And this is $50, so I left that in there. And then we got my girl Tracy over at Girl Mama Budgets with her little wine and the hearts. This one's 75. And then, of course, Wren. Wren. When penguin, penguins find their soulmate, they stay together forever. You're my penguin. Look at that save 50. I love it. I absolutely love it. And then another one from Wren is we go together like peanut butter and jelly so um well it has all the different things but this one's 50 but this is peanut butter and jelly so there you go there's those and let's see I didn't think this would be a very long video I thought I'd get through these quick but apparently I'm just talking way too much but it's giving you time to write down the hashtags right all right hashtag food food I gotta feed you guys, right? Alrighty. Alright, Golden Girls. Golden Girl Budgets. Sorry, Tracy. $50 pancakes. <laughs> now, now Liz has a pancake one out, and she didn't when I ordered all this stuff, so I could have had like a brunch thing. Anyways, Tracy, and then I have this, but I had to get it for you. Guys, I carried a watermelon. If you guys have been around and you know. You know. This is my favorite movie ever. And my bestie stuff made this one. And then we got two Liz's. This one is Let Your Conscious Be Your Guide. I had to look what these were. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know what they were. So I had to look those up, but they look delicious. And then I ordered this one too. It's a Baking Spirit Sprite um, off of her channel. So it's just the Christmas, Christmas cookies. I can't talk. Top number 50, bottom number 175. Ooh, that's a big difference. Huh. All right. 
and then and Desiree debt free by 43 shop there's some rolls in this house hundred dollars denominations one through 15 love it some cinnamon rolls see this was almost like a brunch thing dang it Liz oh what's that oh, but I had a brunch thing going it's okay though ideas for next time so next giveaway if we have a brunch <laughs> we have a brunch you'll know why all right hashtag funny I hope you guys can see these hashtags because I just wrote them in regular ink and I don't have used zoomed in very much but of course you guys know I like all my funny stuff all right Laura Bell creations I used to take a pill for that or I used to care but I, now I take a pill for that look yeah yeah, love it. Save 50, denominations 1 through 10. <laughs> Being a functional adult every day seems a bit excessive. Of course, Lindsay at Boy Mom loves to save. And then I thought this one's so cute, but I took it as... It's totally different than what I think it meant, but it says I need some space. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I thought this was super cute, and I just love that saying, I need some space. I love how she did that. So cute. Oh, all right. My girl, Jamie at Jamie RN Budgets. Kill them with kindness. Save 75. Yes. Yes. And then Carly. <laughs> Budget with Carly. Make your own sugar. Be your own daddy. Save 80. I'm dying. I'm laughing because it's hilarious. And I keep getting notifications on my watch and then my phone and my, I have my tablet over here too. So they're all three going berserker because I have a certain person who's <laughs> talking to me. You guys might be able to guess who she is. <laughs> Love you though. All right. Now here's one of the ones where I had to make a savings challenge. Okay. So it's hashtag hippie. H-I-P-P-I-E. This is one where I had to make one. I had a beautiful one coming from my 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 friend in Romania, but it you know unfortunately the mail hates me. So anyway, so I'm gonna leave that one to last. So the first two are from my bestie Steph. They're her little hippie girls. You guys, these are beautiful. Look at that. Look at the colors. She did such a good job. This one's 50 and this one's 70. Riding on a little scooter, and then rocks. Her little van and this one's 50 dollars. Oh, so cute. And then we got Carmen over at the Humble Budgeter, and I had to make sure that was her because she don't have her name on here, and she usually does. So the little pink bug. So I thought that was cute. And then, all right, here's the one I made. This one is Save 65. It just says Peace and Love, and it just has like little, if you guys see any of the things I make, I always do the transparency very low in the background. Ever since I did my first saving challenge I gave out, the, you know, deer deck and the bug out here, that thing was so colorful. So I wanted to, I mute the colors down. So it's got a bunch of little hippies in the background doing peace signs. This one is denominations one through 10. And yeah, and I don't have an Etsy shop, you guys. It's not Etsy quality. But you guys told me to go ahead and do that. So I did. So that's hashtag hippie. I think we got three more envelopes, you guys. All right. This one is hashtag self-care one word. Self-care one word. And so we have another one from Desiree, debt free by 43. What I love about yoga is the nap at the end. <laughs> I love that. This is $100. Dollars denominations 1 through 15 and then um my bestie staff um a bubble bath i i love a bubble bath it's my downtime during the day so save 50 dollars and i love it and then of course liz this is for me this is the self-care one with the bubble bath and all that so top number is 75 bottom number is 125 if you add them together it's 200 if you times them it's 880 dollars jesus all right, and this was from Rock's Budgets. It's another bubble bath with some wine in there, and that's save 50. And then you guys might have seen this in my haul. Rock sent this to, to me as a freebie, and I said it might go better in this category than, you know, the other thing that I had. So I swapped it, and I gave you guys this one, and I, it's got scratches. I, that's the bad thing about scratch-off stickers. They kind of scratch. It's not scratched through. It's just kind of... I don't know, rubbed off a little bit. This is some fingernail polish. This is $50 from Rocks as well. So I'm trying, I try to be as careful as I can with them, with them scratch-offs. 
All right, that's self-care. All right, two more, two more. This is another one that I had to make. Oh, you need the thing. Um, another one that I had to make a, a challenge. This is hashtag summer, if I can get everything out. Okay, so I'll leave mine to last. Now we got my, my friend Steph, budget with Mama Bear. This little butterfly and bee saved $50. I thought that was very summery and very pretty. And then this one from her, this is definitely summery because it's 4th of July with the little gnome. So cute, save $50. I absolutely love this one and I, I wanted it for myself, but I, I, I held back. And then Tracy, Golden Grove Budgets, popsicles, $50. And then I did order this, you guys, if you see a happy mail. This is um, from Jill at what matters most now. I did order this one, but she sent me one too. So this is a dashboard. It says a gardener's best friend. And that has this gnome just like chilling right here. These got these gnomes on here in the garden. So it's 115 save one through, uh, or sorry, one through 10 denominations. Okay, so that's that. And then here's the one that I made. All right, so yeah, if you've been around, you know my, my boxer Charlie passed away a few weeks ago. So I made a Dog Days of Summer Savings Challenge. Again, it's, you know, the transparency is very low. But this one's 75. I believe the numbers are 1 through 11, I think. Um, you would think I would just remember because I just made it. But no, Dog Days of Summer. He's got the beach behind him with the waves and everything. And he's very muscular. Look <laughs> very muscular but yes that's that's the one I made for summer last envelope you guys last envelope and then we'll move on to the US only all right this one's hashtag taco another one that I had to make so let me get the thing really quick hashtag taco and if you know you know you gotta have the <clears throat> Fantastico from Liz. This one's $50, a very low budget. The pink tacos. And then this one is, oh, I had to write it on the back and because it's not on the front. So I did write it on the back, but you do get to decide what these are about. And it's taco about a party. But this is from Busy Bee Budgeting. She didn't put her name on there, but so I but I wanted you to know who it was from. But I ordered this um very good. And then another one from Carmen. When the most wanted, I think this is the first one. So when you find the taco, save $20. So yes. And then this one's from Rocks. <laughs> taco holic. <laughs> so cute. Save $50. All right. And then here's the last one I made. And it's save $150. It says let's talk about it later. It's got two tacos laying in bed and one's like yelling. <laughs> Save 150. These are denominations from, they're in denominations of five, five, 10, 15, and 20. So save 150 denominations of five. All right, so that's all for everybody. So anybody can enter. If you guys can hear that train, I'm sorry, it's the engine. All right, so you know, I usually always have a binder, always have a binder. And this is my binder, the one I have that I keep my debt savings challenges in. It's from Hobby Lobby. So yes, the binder. And then we got some other stuff in here. You don't want a corner rim, but it's just an A5 binder like the one I have. I think Liz has this one too. But so this one's hashtag binder. And we had um, some unclaimed challenges in our last giveaway. So I am repurposing them for this one. So these are all from Tiffany at Girl Mama Budgets. Um, I actually had the same person the last two giveaways enter and win and not reply. <laughs> so it is what it is. Um, this is her roll and save, the little two little Yorkies. This is a hot dog. This one is a bag of chips and then a soda and a soda. And then also you get a pack of my favorite favorite pens, the Pilot Frixion Clicker the Erasable Pens. So we have black, blue, and purple, and these are 0.7. Fine tip. So there's that. So that's hashtag binder. And with Tiffany's, I have to do some rearranging because hers are different sizes. So 
put that there. Come on. We'll put that in here. So that's U.S. only, guys. Sorry, I'm, you know, the bigger the package, the more expensive it costs. And I'd rather spend my money buying things than having to ship them. So, anyways, I found this the other day. And I grabbed it because I thought it was so cute. I know how many Disney fans I have. So this one's hashtag planner. This is a um, Happy Planner classic simple layout. It's Bambi. And it is um, dated, but it's from July of this year to June of next year. So it's 12 months, but it's Bambi. Can you guys see it? It's 7 by 9. Look at that cover. Find happiness in the journey so it is a disney happy planner and it has i haven't undone these because i didn't want to ruin them but it has all kinds of stickers in here not all kinds i guess two pages of stickers and then you got your layout for the for the year and then these all have because i seen one that was open but these tabs all have a um, bambi picture on them but here's the back of the happy planner so it's a seven by nine love that and here's it's got a um, it's got a calendar as well as like daily layout it looks like it says um 12 month dated planner three bonus months two sticker sheets monthly and weekly calendar pages weekly dashboard sheets dividers space for creative planning and scheduling so there you go so, and then with that, I got these, um, they're called From You Brands, the Catalina Felt Tip Pens. They are 0.7, so they're felt tip pens. So I thought that was kind of neat to write in your new journal or your new planner. So hashtag planner. And can you guys, can you guys guess what the last prize is? I mean, you should, it's been in every one of my giveaways. You guys guessed it yet? Of course you have. <laughs> It's the infamous Golden Girl sticker book. This is the one I do for my randomizer. Um, when I got this, this was the last one at the store. So hopefully they get back in because you know, I love giving these out. So it's the Golden Girl sticker book. It's just like the one I have. Uh, this is the one I'm working on now, Dorothy. It tells you where everything goes. And then here's your sticker pages right here where it goes so yeah and then we also have some more of those um, savings challenges from girl mama budgets so I wanted to give some of those with this so we got the campfire with the marshmallow on a stick and then we got the lantern and then we got the camper and an IOU and then just a note congratulating you for winning the um, giveaway so that's all I have you guys like I said everything and just the envelopes are every anybody can enter this one's kind of a I gotta get it just okay good <laughs> in the right spot everything but these three things are everybody but yeah, so these three things are, inter are U.S. only. All right, one more time with the rules. Ends at May 18th at 11.59 p.m. I will draw the winners that Sunday, and they will be put in with my Monday minis video. I will check to see if you're publicly subscribed. I give you an easy way to see if you are, um, if your subscriptions are public or not. You will have that little red little star or whatever it is. When you click your name, it says public subscriber. If you don't, just Google it. It's super simple. It takes two minutes. It's maybe three steps to do. Um, yes, you must be 18 years older or have your parents' permission and because you have to give me your name and address. And if you give me your name and address, I do have a little book that I keep that has people's names and addresses in because um, if you've ever gotten anything from me before, you know, I kind of like just sporadically sending things out every once in a while. That's why I keep the addresses. Go ahead and like the video and I will, I think that's it. I, I think it's been long awaited. I think it's kind of a little bit of a letdown for how long of, uh, it was waited, but if it had come at the right time, then we would have, my daughter is doing something. I don't know what she's doing. 
<laughs> anyways all right that's it you guys i will talk to you later remember i'm not going to respond to comments i'm just going to heart them if all you're doing is entering in because i don't want to bog down the feed for those so i love you have the best day i will see you guys for my cash stuffing bye